Uzo here, and this is going to be kind of an explanation video of what I'm planning to do with my channel during the War Within pre-patch. So there's been a lot of discussion going on where people are very frustrated with Battleground Blitz. They're frustrated in particular with the quality of the matches and maybe the quality of their teammates. And I feel them. I mean, I am getting extremely frustrated and angry with some of the matches that I've been in. And I want to explain, you know, why that's happening, you know. So my patience level is pretty much on the floor right now when it comes to Battleground Blitz because I've done two seasons of it and this is the third season for me doing Battleground Blitz. In the first season, you know, where everybody was kind of fresh to it and is brand new, you know, everybody's kind of learning how to do things, you know, and I saw things that, you know, people shouldn't be doing but it didn't really make me angry at that time. I kind of laugh it off and just move on to the next match. You know, so I went through season one. Uh, eventually I got all 13 classes to playing above 2K MMR, like 2K to 2.3K MMR. All 13 classes I got into that range. That was kind of a goal that I had set for myself and I had accomplished that. And the quality of those matches definitely improved from the entry level MMR quality matches. Why are they going over there to fight? Why are they fighting over there? There's nothing over there. What the fuck, man? Don't cap, do not do not cap, do not cap, do not cap. You're gonna cap, okay. We have two, we have two bases in the flag and they cap. Now that said, even at higher MMR, Sometimes you would get a like a really bad match where you had a really bad team mismatch where it seemed like You know one team didn't really seem to know what they're doing and the other one did and they just totally destroyed the other team That still happens at high MMR. It just happens less Fortunately, when we moved to the second season, MMR was not reset, so when I jumped back into Blitz, I was jumping right back into matches that were over 2k rated. So things were going great. You know, most of the matches were fine. Uh, people were playing well on both sides of the, of the BG. You know, enemy team was doing well, the friendly team was doing well. And there are, again, there are some matches that were bad, but, you know, they were rare enough where it didn't really make me that angry. But now we're in the War Within pre-patch, right? And I'm back down into these entry-level MMR matches, you know, because MMR got reset. And I am getting incredibly frustrated and angry with what is happening on my team. I have it, but I'm gonna die, yeah. obviously. Ten seconds to rose. Three, <laughs> two, one. Coming over to the graveyard. Well. Holy. Their GPS is so fucking amazing. I can't see you. I'm in that tunnel, kind of. I'm up in the tunnel. Don't, 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 come back. Okay. 
gonna go in after the guy. Damn it! I'm I'm CC. So much fucking CC. Ba, 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 ba. Yes. Oh shit. Was anyone planning on going for the flag? Oh, I certainly wasn't. No. Not me. So let me explain, you know, what makes me angry. Do I get angry because we lose? I mean, I don't like losing, but that's not really the thing that makes me angry. If you have a match where both sides play very well, but one side just plays a little bit better than the other and they win, I never get angry in those type of matches, even when I lose. When I get angry is when I lose matches because people on my team are doing things they should not be doing. That is when I get angry. And I'll get angry in those matches even when my team wins. If I see things that my team shouldn't be doing and we win, I still get incredibly angry. I have, like, again, I said, I have zero patience level right now when I see these things. Now, in the War Within pre-patch, PvP balance is absolutely horrible. You know, elemental shamans are broken. You know, unholy DKs, frost DKs are pretty strong. Some might consider them to be broken. You know, so there's some really strong outlier classes that are broken. There's also some specs and classes that are very weak, you know, and not even worth playing. So I don't really want to talk about the balance between the specs and the classes that much because there's so much imbalance that's happening there. So I'm going to focus more on how you actually win blitzes, the things you should be doing, the things you should not be doing, and the videos I'm going to be putting up are going to be pretty in-depth, right? So I'm going to explain all my decision-making Right, and my intention here is to help everyone who's kind of coming into blitzes. Maybe you haven't even done them before. You know, and I want to take uh, those types of players and help them do better. Right, and you say, wow, that's really nice of you. But in a way, it's kind of selfish. Because as I explained, the most enjoyable blitz matches for me are the ones that are well played on both sides. I don't get much enjoyment for winning a BG because the other side is like, you know, really inexperienced or quote unquote bad. You know, I don't like losing a BG because a lot of my team is inexperienced or quote unquote bad. So I want to go through and talk about Battleground Blitz in a way to help those people get better. And also, um, you could also think of it as a guide of how not to make Uzo angry, right? Nobody wants to make me angry. Everybody likes it when Uzo is nice. Nobody likes it when Uzo is angry. So I'm going to make a guide on how to make sure that you don't make me angry. I'll be starting the series with some Assassination Rogue gameplay in Eye of the Storm. Eye of the Storm seems to be the map that confuses people the most. Okay, so hopefully I'll have that up soon. Until then, take care everybody. Oh, and also, the YouTube algorithm absolutely sucks. So if you want to see these videos, make sure that you see them. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you know when they're up. Okay, take care, everybody.